Share prices in the United States hitting their worst week since the 2008 financial crisis over fear about how badly the coronavirus outbreak will affect the global economy. U.S. Director of the National Economic Council downplayed worries. I just don't think this short-term stock market plunge is going to have any long-term effect. Markets elsewhere plummeted as well on Friday. Jackson Wong is the asset management director at Amber Hill Capital Limited. Well, across Asia, um, all the markets are down significantly because a very, cons uh, very steep consecutive losses from Wall Street because of the worries over the coronavirus spreading across the globe. And even Hong Kong and China markets were holding relatively stable in the previous days. But today, we are all dragged down by the overall sentiment. Meaning uncertainty regarding what's next with the coronavirus. Epidemiologist Boris Lashniak is the dean of Maryland School of Public Health. The reason we worry about it is it's brand new. And it's really uncertain how all this is going to go. That's why we as epidemiologists, I as a doctor, I'm fascinated by this, not scared by this, because I have a faith in the public health system, a faith in medicine that we will ultimately learn a whole lot more about this. Meanwhile, more countries are reporting their first case, including one of the most populous nations in Africa, Nigeria. The case was confirmed on the 27th of February 2020. In Saudi Arabia, where no cases have been reported yet, worshippers pray in Mecca as the country suspends visas for visits to Islam's holiest sites for the Umrah pilgrimage, an unprecedented move triggered by coronavirus fears that raises questions over the annual Hajj, which welcomes millions from around the world. It is normal for people to feel afraid. It is the house of God, which everyone has the right to visit. God doesn't want to hurt his people. God is tender and he loves us. In Japan, parents expressed their frustration with Prime Minister Shinzo Abe's shocking call for all schools to close in a bid to stop the coronavirus spreading as the country prepares to host the Summer Olympics. There's still schoolwork since the third semester is still in session. I think it's troubling that this school shutdown is happening when their grades are about to change. But some signs in China offered hope that the outbreak could be contained. China reported 44 more deaths on Friday with 227 new cases, the lowest daily figure for new infections in more than a month. Mariama Jalou, VOA News.